In today's video, we will take a look and a listen at this, the Kaipro KS Custom Premium S. <laughs> I guess most of you aren't familiar with the brand Kaipro. They are a guitar company from China and they are focusing on building guitars on a pretty high quality level, but for a very reasonable price. The company was already founded in 2015 and they were building guitars for the Asian market for the past years. But now they also want to offer their guitars for players worldwide. What they also do is designing and developing their own guitar pickups so the pickups here in this guitar are also Kaipro pickups. And now let's take a closer look at this guitar. This is the Kaipro KS Custom Premium S. And as the name says, this is more of a premium instrument on the, I would say, higher price range for Kaipro guitars. It is obviously a modern S-type shape with two humbuckers, a three-way switch, one volume and one tone control no coil split, so very simple regarding the electronics. We have a two-piece alder body with a fantastic looking flamed maple top. The neck and the fretboard are also an eye catcher. The neck is made out of roasted maple and the fretboard is made out of flamed maple. Then the hardware, the guitar has a two-point tremolo which is floating and it's all in gold, so the complete hardware is in gold. And then we also have staggered locking tuners with a Kaipro logo on it. And yeah, that's basically it. I will list the full specs here on the screen now because at the moment when I'm filming this video, the guitar isn't listed on their website yet because it's a new 2024 model. <laughs> What I instantly noticed about this guitar is how comfortable it is to play. The neck feels super smooth, it has a satin finish which feels super nice and then also the body contours, so you have these comfort cuts which you know from S-type guitars, but also the transition from the body to the neck is super nicely done, which makes it very simple to play on the higher frets. And I have to point out that this guitar really feels like a high level instrument. And yeah, that's what it actually is. This is a real quality instrument. You can also see it on the close-ups, so the flamed maple looks just stunning. This is also no veneer. I know that the Cheaper Kaipro models have a flamed maple veneer, but that's like a standard thing to do with affordable guitars, but not on this one. And then also the wooden pickup covers and the wooden knobs and also the backplate for the springs and the electronics are looking awesome and it gives a nice contrast to the body color. But my highlight really is the fretboard. This flamed maple fretboard looks just insanely good. Depending on the light, it sometimes looks more or less purple, sometimes more like a wood color and sometimes like a little bit gray. It is just a super beautiful fretboard.
Let's talk about the build quality. The fret ends are nicely rounded. It's maybe not like a really high-end custom shop guitar, but it's well done. So there's nothing sharp or anything that makes playing uncomfortable or painful. The setup was pretty decent out of the box. I only had to adjust the truss rod a little bit, which is fine for me. The action is not super low, but definitely not too high. It's like an average string action, I would say, and it plays very well like it is, so nothing to complain here. And then the vibrato system. I was a little bit skeptical first, but the tuning stability is very, very good on this guitar. The vibrato is floating, so you can go up and down in pitch, and even if you use it more intense, the guitar will stay in tune pretty well. It also has staggered locking tuners, and this might help as well. But yeah, in general, everything works super well and also quality-wise, I can't complain here. Okay, now you heard some different sound samples and yes, this guitar also sounds really good. As I mentioned before, these pickups are also made by Kai Pro and it seems they really know what they are doing. I'm really impressed not just by the sound but everything, so this guitar feels, looks and sounds extremely good. Now is there anything bad on this guitar? To be honest, not really. At least I couldn't find anything like quality wise. There's a little thing that I am missing on this guitar, which is the spoke wheel here on the body to adjust the truss rod. That's something that in my opinion should be on all modern S-type guitars. But other than that, for me, there isn't anything to complain about. But I have to say, this is one of the more premium models from Kai Pro. So I can't tell how the more affordable guitars are quality-wise. Maybe I will get the chance to try one of the more affordable models in the future and then I will keep you updated. At the moment you can only order these guitars at the official website. At least that's what I see, so currently there are no dealers listed as far as I know. But they ship to the US and also to Europe and you find all the information about that on the official website. Link is in the description, of course. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I also recorded a few short videos with this guitar. 
and I will link them down in the video description as well if you want to watch them. And if you enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit the like button and also to subscribe to my channel if you are new here so that we can see each other in the next video.